How's it going YouTube? Chris here, my home theater. Got a brand new video for you this afternoon. As I said in my last video that I would be covering some things today uh, when some stuff came in and uh, just about everything came in today. So I wanna kind of show you guys what I got and uh, we'll kind of talk about it. So let me pan this camera around. So there are my speakers. Those are the Polk Audio. Polk Audio RTIA 1s, and they have the same configuration as my RTIA 9, so that's why I think they're, they'll be a good companion for front wides. And, I mean, they're good quality speakers. This RTI series, that's just pretty awesome. I'll be uh, changing all this right here. I always take them out, make my own little jumpers. I always heard and read that it's better to do that than those little brass pieces. So that's what I've done on my other speakers. Hadn't had any issues, so I'll be doing that. So be excited to get these hooked up. So I wish I could raise the screen and kind of show you what they look like, but yeah. Toy with the idea of where to put them. Still trying to figure this thing out. I, I want to cut a hole in the wall, but I don't know if I want to do it. I just may make a mount but I don't know if it'll look stupid up under the light or do I need to come closer or do I need to go on the other side? That's something that I'm gonna be figuring out here in the next little bit. Um, probably this week. So I'm gonna try to get this room tied up while I'm off. And so the little diffuser panels that I bought, I got some just setting up. So this is what they look like. Uh, they're just, they're just propped up on the wall and the speakers hold them up. But I'm thinking that I'm going to cover this whole back wall, this whole back wall with them. And of course I'm going to have to trim out. Lights mess me up from the projector. So I'm thinking, uh, I'm going to, uh, cover up the wall with these and I'll have to trim them of course, and I'll have to re figure out how to mount my speakers up there, which I'll just, I, I ain't too much worried about that. Now I have to cut out for that, for the um, projector and stuff. So yeah, I think they're gonna look pretty good. And this is what they look like, guys. It's just plastic. Um, it's the backside. And they recommend you put them on with some kind of adhesive tape. So, I'm going to see, I may even, I don't know if I'm going to attack a nail in there, like one nail or something, a little finishing nail. I don't know if I want to do that. I've read some reviews where people have used like two-sided tape and stuff and they hadn't had any issues. So I'm going to try that. But what I want to do is I, I'm, hoping, I'm hoping I got enough. Um, bought two bundles and there's a bunch of them in here. So I'm hoping I got enough to do this whole back wall. And I do want to do cover the front and the bottom. I think it'll look pretty cool. And I mean, it's supposed to diffuse the sound. So we'll see about that. My acoustic panels will be here. Uh, uh, I'm thinking, it says Wednesday, so I'm assuming they'll be here Wednesday. And I bought 12, 12 of those. Uh, it comes six to the order and they're gray and blacks. So I'm assuming there's three grays, three blacks and they're 12, 12 by 48. And uh, I think they're a half inch thick. So, I mean, it's gonna do some absorbing. They'll look good. It should be clean looking. And I'm gonna put those over here. And on this side, I don't know that I'm gonna need any back here. Maybe I, if I do, I'll order some more. Um, but I do, I am gonna put some up here. And, I, and once I get them in, I can figure out exactly what I'm gonna do with that. So yeah, guys, I got right a little bit of stuff in today. Um, I, can't, I can't say enough about this projector. 
and I don't know how HBO is, but you know, hey, here's here's uh, Game of Thrones. It's probably one of my favorite sets. And uh, I'm thinking about doing another, I think about a year or so ago, I've done a video, my top 10 4K movies of all time. And it seems to do good, the video did. And I think I'm gonna do another one because of, of course, there's new movies come out. And of course, when new movies come out and, and you see one that just blows you away, got to add it to the list. So I'll do a revised list and I'm thinking about doing that sometime this week. I may even do it tonight. I don't know. Um, so that's it, guys. Tell me in your comments where you're thinking about <clears throat> where, where you guys think I should put these speakers. So, I mean, I can just, I can buy a stand. I can buy, I mean, I don't know. I kind of like the clean look. I wish I could put them in the wall, um, cut a hole, put them in the wall, mount them sideways. I thought about building a column or something, just like a narrow column and mounting the light on the outside of the column so i've been i've been toying around with some ideas and uh, now it's the time to do it if i'm gonna do it so i mean guys you let me know what you think you think that'd be a good idea mount them in the wall i mean they're not very big uh wish i had a tape measure laying around out here but uh i mean they're not they're not big i mean it's just size of my hand that's a five and a quarter driver so i mean they're not that deep either, but yeah, I, I mean, I could do that. I mean, it would look better than them hanging on the wall. It would make it look cleaner. And I've been thinking about doing a column. Problem with that is, you know, the, the room's not uniform, you know, got, got a door right here and then the door over here is over here. I mean, you got to work with what you got and this is what I got. So you guys tell me what you think. Throw me some ideas, something that I'm, something that I'm missing that I'm not, thinking about um i could mount them up high and angle them down i don't i don't know i just wish the room was wider as most people they go out beyond which is that's what they're supposed to do to go out beyond the the wide channels uh your lcr so yeah so that's the configuration and um so it's not laid out exactly the same because you got the, the woofer, the tweeter woofer, and that has got the tweeter woofer and the port, which is, it's, it's fine. It should should match up pretty good, which I mean, that's the most important matching up right there, in my opinion, is the LCR. Uh, so this front wides, I don't know how active they are. I have no idea. I've never had front wides before. So curious to see how, how it all plays out. But, you know, of course I can't go further this way. I mean, the only thing I can do is come forward. And uh, I said this in another video, uh, what you're trying to do with the front wides is extend the stage out. Really, you're, you're, you're wanting to close the gap from your rear channels, because see, you already got, this is all the way closed up. So you want to extend your surround. So if I did the front wides here, so I mean, that's pretty, pretty pretty good right there so I, i'm you just tell me guys give me some ideas okay give me some ideas help me out and uh we'll get this thing rolling and get it put in i'll whip up some columns and i cover them fabric or paint them or do something i'll figure something out so just need y'all's help y'all tell me what you want to do what i need to do okay and again there they are there's my little diffuser panels so We'll get them put up here while we're off. Cause this old boy is toward, really toward. <laughs> Southern slang, toward. I'm, I'm very tired, guys. So anyway, let's paint this camera around. Let's, let's tie this video up. So that's my little update today. Just got a new, few things in. Got a got a right good amount of movies today. I think I got five or six movies today. I got more coming probably the next day or two. and. Just trying to, you know, trying to take advantage of the uh, <clears throat> the Black Friday deals, even though most of the movies I've got because I pre-ordered just about everything that comes out. And I got to slow down, but I'm, I'm a movie collector and 
and my movies are, uh, they're exploding. So I'm gonna have to figure some things out of where I'm gonna store them, where I'm gonna keep them. And, uh, but anyway, that's, that's a passion of mine. So anyway, guys, that's my video for tonight and hope everything is looking good to y'all. It's looking good to me. Just got to get out here and get some stuff done. <clears throat> But uh, we'll do that this coming week. So, guys, y'all have a wonderful week. And if I don't see you again before Thanksgiving, which I may, I may see you again before Thanksgiving. And uh, But if I don't, just in case I don't, I hope everybody has a safe and wonderful Thanksgiving. And we'll see you again real soon.